Hey, Steve. Well, uh, that scary scene all playing out right here in this parking lot. You can see the area still taped off right now as that investigation continues. Multiple police units on scene. The investigation all centering around that blue car right there in the parking lot. Now, we did speak with an eyewitness who tells us that he was coming here to grab his food. He says somebody got out of that car uh, and immediately told him that she had shot another woman and that he needed to call 911. This is what he says happened next. We pull up, the young lady jumps out of the car and said, call the police because she had shot someone. Um, she had been, uh, I think she she'd been assaulted by this other victim. So she shot her twice and she was running up the street just saying that she'd been, you know, she was screaming. And so I called the police and they finally got here. Within five minutes, they was here. And all of a sudden that we were looking for the young lady that got shot. And someone else, she eased, she went around the building, she's in the bathroom in the alehouse, and the manager came out and said that she was in the bathroom, and, the, and then they went in there and took out. Now, as you just heard from him right there, the victim uh, was apparently inside in the bathroom uh, when she was taken out. But uh, other than that, it appears all of this went down in the parking lot. We don't know how that victim is doing. Uh, we, it, do, it does appear that the suspect and the victim knew each other in this case. But beyond that, we don't have any new information other than what we were told by that witness. That is obviously part of the investigation right now. We're going to continue pushing uh, Durham police for more information. But as of right now, uh, the restaurant has been cleared out as they continue to investigate. Reporting live in Durham, Tom George, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.